Hey guys, I'm Bomb Beautiful, and today we're doing another Pokemon Go look, and this time I'm starting to do people, not just Pokemon. So I'm going to show you how to do this misty look in three easy steps. One, two, three. So if you want to see how I did this, then first hit the subscribe button down below, and let's go. Step one is the eyes. So I'm going to start with this white eyeshadow pencil and I'm going to put it all over the lid. Then I'm going to use my finger to blend it out. Then I'm going to start with this cool toned brown and this one's called Grace. It is an itsy eyeshadow and I'm going to start applying that into the crease and I'm going to shape out my crease. Then I'm going to use a clean blending brush to blend it all out. Then I'm going to start working on the eyebrows. Yes, this is glue. And I'm going to start applying it onto my eyebrows and really flatten out my eyebrows. I love using glue because you can wash it off with water and it will come completely off so it's really easy. So I'm going to be going back and forth. I'm going to be using the glue, then I'm going to put a white eyeshadow pencil, pencil over top of it. Then I'm going to go back to the glue and then back to concealer. So just so you know, it's a lot of back and forth. But while that dries, I'm going to be going into like a peachy shade and a brown. And then I'm going to go back into the e.l.f. shadow palette and go into this warm brown and apply that into the crease to deepen it up a tiny bit. Then I'm using a clean blending brush to blend it out. So like I said earlier, we're going to be using the white eyeshadow pencil, then the glue, then the concealer. So just until your eyebrows look bald, which is what we want. We don't want you to have eyebrows because we're going to be painting some in. So I'm going into two light yellows in this palette and I'm going in with an eyeshadow brush. This one's from Wet n Wild. I chose this one because it's super flat and the end of it is super pointy. So I'm going to be using the e.l.f. lock and seal to intensify that yellow and then I'm going to blend it out. Then I'm going to go into this blue and I'm going to use that same flat eyeshadow pencil and I'm going to get right into the tip of it and I'm going to start kind of giving myself a cut crease. We're not going to have a cut crease, but we're going to start shaping it out like as if we were going to do a cut crease. Then I'm getting into a black and I'm going to do the exact same thing to deepen that blue up a tiny bit. Then I'm getting into this navy blue and a crease brush and I'm going to apply it right above where we did the cut crease. And then we're just going to blend it out so it looks really blended. Then, like I said earlier, we're going in with concealer. We're going to hide our eyebrows. So this is what you want. You want to look bald. And then I'm going in with this Grace Itsy eyeshadow and I'm going to go back in because the concealer kind of wiped away some of that color earlier. So step two, we're going to start doing the face. So I'm starting with these, mixing these two foundations. This is the CoverGirl by Set Gorgeous and the L'Oreal Infallible Pro Glow. And I'm going to apply that using the BH Cosmetic Beauty Sponge, which I am loving. And then for concealer, I'm using this one and it's called the Age Rewind Concealer. And I'm also going to highlight with it. And this one is the neutralizer one. Then I'm going to set it all, eyebrows, concealer, everything with this itsy face powder called The Fog. Then I'm using the Makeup Lock and Seal and I'm going into this itsy shadow called Golden Gate 
You just want like a matte orange and I'm going to start sculpting out my eyebrows. So I'm going to switch brushes and use eyeshadow without the makeup lock and seal to go over top of that. Then I'm using the same orange to go in the lower lash line and I'm going to really blend it out. Then I'm going to line my lash line. So I'm not going to do a wing or anything fancy. I'm going to keep it very, very simple and make my eyes look very, very round like the cartoon. Then I'm going to tight line with this black eyeliner and then line my waterline with this white eyeliner from Wet n Wild. Then going back into that black, I'm going to just apply that onto the lower lash line. Then just apply your mascara, curl your lashes, put on falsies if you want. I did choose to put on false lashes. I feel like it looked better with this look. And the false lashes that I chose are from LA Colors. They're called Foxy. And I really, really like these. I think they were perfect. Then I'm going back into this black eyeliner and I'm gonna start making myself look a tiny bit more cartoonish. Um, so don't mind what's going on in the chin area. I did it and then I'm gonna erase it later. But anyways, I'm using a shimmery white shadow and I'm applying some white spots, kind of like the cartoon. And then I'm going to ap apply the Clinique blush in big, just to give myself a flush of color. Now step three, the lips. So I am going to make them look as cartoonish as I can. This is the LA Color uh, Black Liquid Eyeliner. And I'm going to start making some creases on my lips. And then the lip product I'm using is from Wet n Wild. It's the Velvet Matte Lip Color in Looking for Truffle. Then I'm going to bronze now that my beard is gone. <laughs> and this one is from Tarte. And I'm just contouring slash bronzing. And then I'm using this e.l.f. eyeshadow, which is very shimmery, and I'm applying that into the chin area. And then that's it. I hope you guys have been enjoying this Pokemon series. If you missed any of the Pokemon that I've done, I will link them off down below as well as at the end of the video. So make sure to go check them out. And if you really like this look and this Pokemon series, then hit the like button. And thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you guys next time. I'm sizzling right now. I am sizzling right now. We've done Squirtle, Pikachu, and now Charmander. I'm playing Pokemon. I want to be the very best, like no one ever was. Them is my real test.